you know, there there could in the future be, you know, deep fake synthetic versions of each of us having this talk right now. And then also taking every other digital form of talks or typing all of our Google takeout, everything we've searched for, or texted or written an email to somebody on, uh, that can be recomposited into a synthetic being that uh, plays as a as an agent with somebody you could talk to. We've already been doing this in the MIT Media Lab. You know, you build a little agent that's for the deceased professor and ask what that one would have thought, right? Actually, one is a Marvin Minsky bot, and he's one of the ones who also signed up for cryogenics, and that hasn't um, resurrected him yet, but we can resurrect some of what he said online with a digital form. And it's a kind of immortality, right? I find it interesting, though, that we, uh, so many people I know who aren't, uh, you know, who haven't thought that much about God or what they believe in the afterlife still desire it. It's almost like we're made for it. Some people say, you know, you're hungry because you're made to eat food. You're thirsty. You're made to, to drink. Um, maybe we are, uh, there's something in us that is immortal, that desires immortality. 